Love makes people better. I've seen it in Caleb and Phil. Love inspires you, right? To want to do things for each other. We've been through so many challenges over the years, individually and together. I'm so glad you've been my partner through it all. Although I'm not sure about many things in life, I'm sure that I love you and I promise to choose to love you every day. This is the story of Caleb and Felicia. It is not hard to see they complement each other perfectly. For years, they were going together swimmingly. Then Caleb decided to go to Germany <laughs> to finish his studies, he said. But what would be the outcome we dread? They became... Uh, they became... Uh, <laughs> well, more romantic. <laughs> you were my first in everything. We've been through a lot, but marrying you is a promise that we will have a partner through anything for life. You'll always be the first I come to in my life, and I promise to always put Christ at the center of our marriage. I can't wait for the beginning of our new life together. I love you. I just ask or wish for you that you will continue to encourage each other and bring out the best in each other. At some point, just around the time in year 12 when she told me, Daddy, I have a boyfriend. <laughs> Hearing those words gave me chest pains. <laughs> and then soon enough, we met Caleb. And of course, I liked Caleb straight away. And look at him, fine, upstanding young man, sensible, well-mannered, no prior criminal convictions that I could find. <laughs> Caleb and Fel, I've seen you both steadily build God into your life. I'm so thrilled in the years that I've known you, how you've brought out not just the best in each other, but you've encouraged each other to step up to Christian maturity. Perfect timing, sun is shining, nothing more. I also want to take this opportunity to welcome Felicia into our family. Tomorrow, I'll put her into our Brown family WhatsApp group. <laughs> I promise that you will be my sole confidant and the one who knows me best. And although I'm still amazed at how God orchestrated our story, I promise to always speak God's truth into your life and choose to show you more love than you'll ever need. I promise to love you the way Christ loves us, with the kind of love that is sacrificial, unconditional, and unfaithful. I look forward to the many introductions I'll have as your wife. I love you 3,000. Right.